third day, the dose of coronavirus. Day four, part one. March twenty, Mar March twenty two, twenty twenty. Hello everyone. So I know I have been doing daily dose of coronavirus for two days, but I promise at least for the next week I'll upload a video of coronavirus, of daily dose of coronavirus every single day. So. We kind of have a little bit to catch up on. So since I was gone, we had 80,000 cases now. Today just might be, today might be the worst day of coronavirus for the fourth day in a row. What is bad? We're about to get one third, one third of a million cases. And that is a lot. And the USA moved up to number three on all um, cases. For coronavirus, I ran at least watching as bad as a U.S. or anyone like that. <laughs> so, without further ado, let's go in. China obviously is good. Italy still having a pretty bad outbreak there. More than f almost sixty thousand cases in, in probably just like three days or something. In two or three days, it's probably gonna overtake China for the most coronavirus cases. Then we have the U.S., which I, I can say is doing as bad, maybe not as bad as Italy right now, but I don't know about that, just my, my opinion. California, California, more than 1, 1,600 cases. Washington, almost 2,000. Texas, almost about 600. Florida, almost 1,000 cases. We have at least six states that have 1,000 cases. Washington, California, no, it was Washington, California, Illinois, Michigan, New York, and New Jersey. Wait, is that six? Washington, California. So, yep, that's only six have more than 1,000 cases right now. That's going to change quickly, and obviously, as we know, New York is the epicenter of the U.S., and they aren't doing that well. They have more than 15,000 cases. Probably almost all of those cases are in New York. It's so right here, maybe, probably, it just like maybe that area, maybe, there's 15,000 cases with like 10 million people. I mean, the chances are, the chances are like high, like 1 in 10, 1 in 25, but you should be very cautious, that's why they, well that, and that's why New York has gone in a lockdown. So, and Europe obviously, is, Europe is probably the worst content, <coughs> Europe is probably the worst content to get hit altogether. All across Europe, the least amount of cases in main Europe is, I believe, I don't know. Most of them are pretty bad. The baddest boy being Italy. Then we got France. We also have Switzerland. But then we have Spain, the fourth most. Then we have Germany. Almost 24,000 cases. Like I said, this is not good. Many schools are resorting to at least sort of an online school for now. We have 107 countries that have been affected so far. And if we refresh this, we can also see how many have recovered, how many have died, almost 15,000 fatalities from this deadly disease, almost 100,000 are recovered, so that's, <laughs> that, that's kind of good, even though this is going like really high, then it'll probably be like that, then it'll eventually go down, 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 once some vaccine is released or something happens, but that probably won't be for a while, so, Obviously, mainland China is doing its normal pretty good. Total recovery has actually gone up quite a lot. But other locations, uh, it's going up and it's not good. The largest amount, at least, was yesterday with 32.4 thousand cases. Uh, yeah, that's just not good. Not good at all. At least not ours, but, but, but this information right here is pretty inaccurate because... It changes. If we go to active cases, of course, China is now not that bad, you know. It only has like 5,000 existing cases right now. So, 
I guess probably the worst country to hit all of right right now the worst country. I know Italy is in terms of the worst in cases, but yeah, I think Italy's probably still the worst one right now. But US is starting to pick up traction on the coronavirus. What's crazy is just the New York outbreak. Look, there's oh, there's almost sixteen thousand people. And sadly, West Virginia did get some cases, but I don't think that there have been any fatalities there, probably, because then that'll make the fatality rate there about maybe 8%, 8.5%, I do believe. Canada, still doing, um, they have the exact same cases as what do this. Canada, obviously, they are a very good health country, but they can't defend every single case, so it's not going to go down to zero. But they are handling like, pretty well. So, like, the, the northern states are, never mind, except, except for the big ones like Washington, except for the big ones like Washington and, you know, Michigan and I'm not gonna say, I mean, New, New York, the cases are pretty much just like, but most of the cases are in New York, you know? So, obviously, that's fine. Really, the only thing that's bad is Seattle, Michigan, and maybe New York. So, it seems like the North is pretty safe for now, I guess. And then, Oklahoma, 67 cases. Colorado, almost 500 cases. And now, let's see a map of the entire thing. This is your daily dose of coronavirus, day four, day four, part one, March 22nd, 2020. So long, goodbye.